Uh, my Leinster Championship moment is the 2004 Leinster semi-final against Kilkenny. I want to remember for Mick Jacobs' goal, but it's probably the lead up to it was more significant in regards to the panel. We were going bad in the league, we had Dublin in the relegation final of the league and we kind of sat down together before they came up with a plan. Thankfully we bet Dublin, we went on to play Cork and Galway, two challenge matches and they went really well. And we kind of kept it very quiet and we went into the Leinster semi-final against Kilkenny. I think we were 12-1 to 1 to win that match and nobody really gave us a chance but it's probably the first team I was involved with that everybody bought into a team and management into the plan that we went in with. And Look, it worked out really well. Coming into the last couple of minutes, we were a couple of points down and we got a, a line ball that Adrian Fennett hit really well and that's where the, the memorable goal came into it. And to beat Kenny in the manner we did, we had been beaten by him so many times in different Leinster Championship games. To do it the way we done it, we didn't give him a chance to come back. I remember the ball being poked out and Cody falling to his knees and that was the, the moment really that capped off that was a massive amount of work that went into it. Have deprived Kilkenny in the very last cup of the match. The cup of joy is overflowing down on the banks of Slaney sides. They cannot believe it. What a way to beat the All Ireland champions. Their Leicester Championship crown is gone. Wexford are in the Leicester final. I say to follow on from that, I suppose. Um, from a more sentimental point was the Leinster final of that year, 2004, and um, Wexford playing awfully. And obviously, I'm at that game with my father, who hence has passed since then. But like all Leinster championships for me, the best memories of Leinster Champ for me is going to matches with him when I'm young, and you're stopping for your picnic on the way up, and all the extra cars, and you're just meeting everybody in the banter. But to be sitting with him that day when we looked under pressure, and, and then for Paul, his son, to get the goal, and I'll never probably forget the expression on his face. Um, it was a really big proud moment for him, I'd say. Obviously having six sons and coaching us all, and I think he found that probably the pinnacle of all the work that he ever pushed us towards playing the game of Ireland, that it kind of came true in that moment, and that always kind of stood out with me. And obviously then backing that up and winning the Leicester Championship, but for me, that's where I feel that Leicester Championship sits with me, and, and it was a really good memory of that time, and, and it's not a memory that I'll forget. So that's where I am in 2004. But Carly knew how to beat a goalkeeper since he was once a goalkeeper himself.